All right, uh, let's look at an example of uh, free damped motion. Right? Here's the differential equation and the initial conditions given. All right? So uh, let's look at its uh, characteristic equation. So it's going to be uh, 25 r squared plus 10 r plus uh, 226 equals 0. All right, so I'm going to use quadratic formula here. So R is going to be equal to, all right, so you have a negative B, so negative 10, uh, plus or minus square root of, all right, uh, 10 squared, so it's 100, minus, 4 times 25 times 226, so you have a 226 with two zeros, over 2 times, say, 2 times 25 is uh, 50. All right, so you can see that, uh, let's see, you have a 10, negative 10 divided by 50, so it's going to be negative 1 fifth and the plus or minus, all right, so what's this number here? Um, so it's a 100 minus uh, 22,600 would be a negative uh, 22,500. All right, so if you take the square root of that, uh, what would that be? So I'm gonna take a 2500. Zero, zero. So we have uh, two zeros, uh, so I'm going to do a 10. So it's a 2, 2, 5, 0. And I'm going to pull out 10. So it's a 2, 25. And then we can do uh, maybe 5. And 45. And another 5, 9. And the 3, 3. So it seems like it's going to be, let's say, 3 times 5 times 10, so it's going to be 150, All right? So we have um, uh, 150i over uh, 50, so it's going to be 3i, right? Because 150 divided by th uh, 50 would be 3. All right, so we have that. So therefore, uh, we have um, the form of the solution. Uh, x going, is going to be, right, some, uh, let's see, uh, you have exponential functions, so you have a e to the uh, negative uh, uh, t over 5, right, then times, right, uh, a times cosine of uh, 3t, plus uh, b times sine of uh, 3t, right? Because we have uh, complex roots there, all right? Then let's try to find uh, uh, the value of a and the value of b uh, using the initial value conditions. So we plug in uh, t equals 0, all right? So if you plug in 0, e to the 0 is 1, and the cosine of 3t is going to be 1, so it's going to be just a, and uh, sine of 0 is 0, all right? Since uh, this is equal to uh, 20, so we put 20. So we know that uh, a is 20, all right? So let's take the derivative, so x prime of uh, t is going to be all right, I'm going to have to use a product rule here. So derivative of the first guy would be uh, negative 1 over 5 e to the negative t over 5 times uh, what we have here. So it's a, a cosine of 3t. I guess uh, we didn't really have to use the bracket. Maybe I'll, use, I'll just use... Um, a regular parentheses here, so here, like that. All right, then same thing here. 
right, a cosine of 3t plus uh, b sine of uh, 3t, right, and plus, right, leave the first guy alone, so we have a e to the negative t over 5, then multiply by derivative, so derivative of that is going to be negative 3a uh, sine of uh, 3t plus 3b cosine of uh, 3t. Right? So we got that. Then we plug in uh, t equals 0. So x prime of 0 is equal to, right? Uh, plug in 0 here, so it's going to be negative uh, 1 over 5. And then uh, plug in 0, so it's going to be a. So we already know that a is 20, so I'm going to put 20 here. All right? Plus, all right? e to the 0 is 1 again. Then you have a sine of 0 is 0, so this goes away. So you have a 3b, uh, so it's uh, 3b times 1, so it's 3b. All right, so what you get is going to be, let's see, so negative um, uh, 20 times 5, uh, oh, divide by 5 would be negative 4. So negative 4 um, plus 3b uh, is, oh, actually 3b, sorry. I meant uh, 3b. And this is supposed to be equal to uh, 41 here. So set that equal to 41. And then uh, we can just add 4 to both sides. You have a 3b is equal to uh, 45. All right, then we can just uh, divide through by 3 to find a b value. So b is going to be uh, 15. All right, so we got that. So therefore, uh, we have this complete formula. Actually, I'm gonna I'm gonna go down here. So therefore, uh, we have this uh, x of t is gonna be equal to uh, e to the negative t over five. All right, a came out to be twenty, so it's uh, gonna be a twenty uh, cosine of 3t and plus uh, b came out to be 15 sine of uh, 3t. Right? And then we can rewrite this guy uh, in terms of simply a cosine function. So all you have to do is uh, I'm going to take, uh, so let, um, so that we can rewrite this guy as uh, c times e to the negative uh, alpha t over 5 cosine of 3t minus alpha. All right? Then uh, we say where? All right, so c is uh, pretty easy to find. All you have to do is uh, c is going to be uh, square root of uh, a squared plus b squared. So in this case, uh, a is 20, so it's going to be uh, 400. All right? So b is equal to 15. So what's 15 times 15? And uh, 25 and 75 and plus 50, so 200. Uh, so uh, maybe I should write that. So it's at two, 225, right? So 225. And so we, we have a square root of uh, 625, which I believe is equal to 25, right? Then alpha is going to be simply 
Uh, since uh, A is positive, uh, B is positive, so we are talking about um, uh, first quadrant. So this is going to be just an arctangent uh, B over A, which is equal to arctangent uh, B is uh, 15 and A is 20. So we have an arctangent of uh, 3 over 4. Right. So we have uh, x of t is equal to uh, c is 25 times e to the negative t over 5 cosine of 3t minus arc tangent of 3 over 4. Right. So that's the solution of this given initial value problem. Right. And uh, you can see that if you check, um, since um, this value right here is a c squared minus 4mk, uh, let's see, so a uh, different equation was looking like this, right? So it's going to be uh, x double prime, and uh, so actually mx double prime uh, plus uh, uh, c x prime and plus um, k x equal to zero, right? And so if you look at this um, expression, that would be c squared minus four uh, m k, and this came out to be negative, uh, which tells you that this is an um, underdamped case. Right, but anyway, so what you do is you solve the differential equation using a characteristic equation, and use the given uh, initial value condition to find a and b, and after that we can just rewrite it in terms of just a simply cosine function, so that uh, we can we can uh, understand the behavior a little bit better. All right, uh, that's it. I hope that uh, this was clear.